guys, you know what, you know what time this is, yeah, you, yeah, you. I do not know what happened, but today is the, is, is Fallen Countdown Episode 6, which is, of course, the, about the novel. Let's begin, shall we? So, basically, um, so the first notable death is of a character that never made it into the actual movie. His name is Ed Regis, and he was, well, actually, he didn't make it into the movie, kind of. In the movie, he was that, he was that guy, take, he was that guy staring at the, uh, staring at the sick triceratops. You know, this guy? No, that was a good, different guy. Okay, actually, here's Ed Regis. I forgot who the who the guy staring at the at the sick Triceratops was, but Ed but in the book Ed was more of a jerk. They they eventually they decided to and fun fact in the first in the first screenplay that Michael Crichton did. For the movie Jurassic Park, they Michael actually want wanted Donald actually well, actually had Donald Donald Gennaro be cut out instead of Ed instead of Ed. So yeah, but they decide to to cut most of Ed out and and replace. Place Donald Donald's Donald's personality with Ed's personality, and just and just like and like like Gennaro, like movie Gennaro, Regis died. Regis got killed by a T Rex, but it was different. And his death would actually be reused in the Lost World for Peter Ludlow. Yep, this dude, this dude got mo got nommed on by a baby T Rex, and the kids for too. So on to the next death. <laughs> Images at the uh, flash. What the heck's happening, dude? Oh. Okay, works normally now. So the next step is. Ah! Just come on, stop, stop glitching, stop. I think that fixed it. Ah! Okay, enough with the joking. The next step is. And. Basically, what happened is, so, the next death is not really death, it's in Malcolm, I think he got, like, I think he got, like, I think he got bit by the T-Rex and had a leg infection, and, and, Died, but they could revive the doctors. Managed to revive him. I think that's what happened. I've never read the novels before. Let me just say that. But I have seen a summary of them, so I'm good. Anyways, so another death is that is that little girl. Back to the real deaths. The little girl that got attacked by the copy survived. You idiot. Okay, jeez, look, okay, I'll do it. Dennis Nedry. Okay, this stall officer looks awesome. So basically, Dennis Nedry was getting his. 
So Dennis Negri was 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 on his was going on his way to to get off the island with the dinosaur DNA, but he had one problem. He was lost and out of gas. So he got got out of his car. But suddenly he heard a noise. He thought it was nothing. But suddenly <laughs> a Dilophosaurus came out and with with leopard leopard patterns leopard like patterns on his body. And it was twice the size of him. So he acted like a normal like a normal human one and started backing up. And it was pretty much the the movie vice versa because because the the dying officer start start basically taunting him I guess so so our genius thought it was no big deal and the thing was like a herbivore or something that wasn't really aggressive oh he was wrong because it barfed at him and now he's blind. So, after a little bit of waiting for Dennis to realize that he's blind, well, the dialogue officer just slices his stomach open. So, so the dialogue officer just watches as as, De as Dennis re realize, realizes that he's, hold that he's holding in his intestines and <laughs> chomp. He just crushes his head. Wait, 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 what the heck? Why, wait, 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 what? Why, why, wait, what? That's not the heck. And it bites, bites his head and crushes it. And then dead. Not, not that much. And now for, for our scientist of the movie. And the novel. Henry Rue plays a much more important character, kind of like, kind of like in, kind of like, in the in the Jurassic World trilogy. But basically, what happens is he he runs straight out. He runs straight out. Like, nope, I'm out of here. The Raptors are attacking the lab. I'm out of here. So he runs. Um, okay, I'm sorry. This, this is this is literally the closest image I could find to to Henry Wu running. So yeah. So anyways, Henry Wu is running away from the lab when suddenly a raptor, a raptor, a raptor pins and, and pounces on him and pins him down. And guess what it does? Guess what it does? This apparently Jura apparently Jurassic World boop. apparently Jurassic World boop. apparently Jurassic the Jurassic Park novel had an accept uh, an odd an odd obsession with dinosaurs ripping people's stomachs open. You two, please have mercy on me, John Hammond. John Hammond. So, a fact that ev that pr probably everyone knows by now. Uh, John Hammond was more of an antagonist in the books. So basically, in the novel, he was he was a greed, greedy butthole who only cared for the park. And not for actual, for not for his, for people's lives. Heck, he even he didn't even care care about his grandchildren. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Um. Someone needs to take. He's a he's a bad grandparent, you know. So the combies were gonna be in Jurassic Park. The first one. And they were gonna be Venice. 
So a pack of compies would would. So a pack of compies would swarm 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 a swarm a pretty small area, a hill. So John Hammond John Hammond just speeds out of there, and. And he ends up losing his footing and tumbles down the hill. And just like that, there goes his ankle. So the compies track him down and eventually catch up with him. And as they bite and bite more and more into into into, into the park owner's flesh, more and more venom is injected. And then the pain goes away. And the and and the cancelled pain and the can the cancelling of the pain only lasts for and that and the and the, the and those moments when when John didn't feel pain again were his final moments. So I don't I don't really know any more notable deaths from the novels. So yeah. Um I'll see you tomorrow. Sayonara.